Hey, this is actually today we're going to do Christmas cookies. First of all, you repeat your oven. First of all, you're going to preheat. You're, you're going to preheat your oven at 3 feet degrees. 350 degrees. The parchment paper is what you're going to cut your cookies on, so so they'll look good. Here are our cookie cutters. We have a whole lot of different kinds, except there's two Benjamin men. So we're not going to do both of them. So if 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 you if y'all don't have a Benjamin man, we'll give it to you. Well, you know how y'all turn it this way? It's supposed to go this way. And then this is a reindeer, but it's kind of like a shirt. Wrinkled. <laughs> a wrinkled shirt. <laughs> It kind of looks like a what? Drink cool shirt. <laughs> so you have to earn this shirt. <laughs> okay. Before you start, don't forget to wash your hands. I already washed mine. It's called cookie dough. And we'll get real messy during this. So... You have to smash it down really hard. Smash, 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 and smash everywhere just so you can get it good and flat. We had to start over because that way it didn't work. So now we're putting the cookie dough on the pan. Now with the bell, you have to smash, smash, and then you have to I'm pushing all of it away. See how I'm pushing it? Like this. I'm pushing. I'm blocking it with that. And then look. It's gently get it all off. Because some of it is way up next. And you have to take it off. Take the stuff off. And you have to put it on there. Like really, really good. And then you see how I'm doing this. I'm jiggling at it just a little bit. And then I'm trying to get it way off here. I think. You know how whenever it's snowing, it, the, the snowflakes come like that, come down? And so you have to just press it. Oh, down. Like. I'm blocking it. I'm blocking it. And then whenever I block it up, pick it up. Get it. You can buy a whole lot of different sprinkles. So we're only 
We're only gonna do a little bit. Like this. So we're gonna spread them out. Just like just like this. And then we're gonna get the green. This is this isn't hard because you can just sprinkle it on. Just like salt. So And then you get the red kind, and you sprinkle it on a little bit. And then you get the white kind, and you sprinkle it on the candy cane. And then for the gingerbread man, you get the green. it on his head and then get the red and sprinkle it on a little and then do that then you can sprinkle it over a little bit so you can see the green too. You just see the green and the red because that's a Christmas color. So you need to see the green and the red. Now we're going to bake 350 from 10 to 12 minutes. And then next, after these, we're going to do some more. So you're going to come over here. We'll be back in I Shelby. We're going to take a little bite of the cookies cook. They got done fast, fast, and the candy cane got fast, and the bell got fast, and hmm, um, the gingerbread teared up, <laughs> and um, and we're getting, and, and there's, I can't, I forgot what that is. Is it this um? um Snowflake. The, the snowflake cooks dry and good. And we're going to let this cool and we're going to taste it in a minute. See if it's cool. You touch it. Now, we're, I'm going to taste this and see if it's yummy. Mmm, this tastes good. this every year. What do you do at grandma's at grandmother's house? I'm at grand's house making cookies from for my mom and dad because I'm spending the night for three not for four nights. And but today is three nights. So we're gonna talk about on my Shelby hat hat what do you do on grandmother's house? At grandmother's house I mean. So this is the end of our Tune back in sometimes and watch another show. Bye-bye.